Good morning. Welcome. Hi, Mary. Okay, so we're going to get started uh, right out the gate today. And I know you guys are like, well, she's really lost it. This is it. It's over. She's on the floor. Like this, you know, this is the Facebook Live where we know Wendy has lost her mind. I'm also wearing, look at the pants I'm wearing. Can you see them? <laughs> I'm wearing tie-dyed, like comfy pants because I just wasn't in the mood to put on jeans today, which I got to tell you, I don't know if any of you have this, but there's something about putting on jeans that makes me more productive. And unfortunately, when I wear like comfier clothes, it makes me less productive. Is that weird? Do any of you have that? It's like I have to get dressed up. I did my hair, I did my makeup. Uh, I did forget to put lipstick on before I went live. But um, I just wanted to be comfy today. So I was like, I'm not putting on jeans. <laughs> they are fun pants. I got them at Old Navy actually and I really kind of wish I would have gotten a couple of pairs because they're really comfortable um okay so anyone want to guess why I'm sitting on the floor what might I be sitting on the floor for to to tell you or show you yeah totally is a mindset Janie 100% like there's just something about like getting dressed in certain clothes that makes me feel more like productive. It's weird. It's very weird. Thank you for sharing it, Patricia. Okay, so we are not going to craft today. Just so you have a heads up. Um, I'm actually, nope, Rachel, you're close. I'm actually going to be showing you um, some product that is on sale because the last chance list is still out there. There's stuff still available and I feel like people are missing out on a bunch of the sales. So I took some time before we went live and this isn't everything, but I wrote out a bunch of post-it notes um, on stuff that is retiring and that's on sale. So I thought I would show it to you so you guys could see some of the cool stuff that is on sale um and i didn't even realize i didn't even realize how inexpensive some of this stuff was how much it was marked down so like this punch for example this is the confetti flowers punch and it is that's another one it is marked down to nine dollars and twenty cents did you guys know that like, I didn't even realize how much this stuff was marked down. So, I'm on here to show you a few of these items because you want to grab them before they're gone. They won't be, you know, forever. And um, I wanted to just, it'll help me go through a few of these items and mark them myself. So, this is the Classic Label Punch, which is one of my favorite punches. And it's $14.40. So it's marked down really good. And there is a link in the description of this video to order from me. I do have a host code right now that um, if you purchase 50 or more with me, um, you receive a free embellishment from the new catalog. However, I didn't put the host code on here before I went live. So don't worry about it. Just place your order and I'll put the host code in for you later. So it's not a big deal. Don't be stressing over that. Hi in Wisconsin. This scallop tag punch is marked down to 20 bucks, 2070. Super, super good deal. Did any of you that are my customers receive your catalogs? I would love to know who has received their catalog. Okay. And this is the perennial flower punch which also looks like a helicopter, or not a helicopter, a pro, uh, plane propeller, and it is 720. So that's marked down really good. Um, oh, the dockside dies. These are those dies that have the little boat 
Oh my gosh, they're so cute. There's a bow, a frog, a dock. I use these to make some cards. There's a little um, grass, like grass hill. Guys, these are 10 bucks. Mark down to 10 bucks. Okay, what else do we have in here that I wanna, oh, the apple punch, this apple punch. I love punches that are their own shape because you don't even need a stamp set for this, right? You can just get the punch and make some cute apple goodies for class stuff. 720, 720. I couldn't believe how much stuff was marked down that I didn't even realize. I kind of feel silly. And this isn't even everything. This was just what I could kind of like grab prior to going live. Um, let me look for, hmm, where is that at? Oh, here they are. Is this them? No, that's not them. That's not them. There's those really cute um, Stampin' Up boxes that have the Stampin' Up logo on them. They're three bucks. I don't have any because I've used them all up, but they're $3. They're, they're $3. They're the little cardboard looking boxes with the Stampin' Up logo. They're so cute and they're only three bucks. I think I'm actually going to buy some and have them on hand for when I do an event so that I could like package it in that and make it really cute. I think that would be fun. I've, I've used them in the past for an event, but I think I'll use them again. Okay. Oh, here's another punch that is marked down quite a bit. The umbrella punch, $7.20. I just can't believe some of these. Oh, a whole bunch of the embossing folders are marked down. So this one is marked down to $9. This is the Scripty 3D embossing folder. I'm trying to open it here for you. It's got like, can you guys see that? It's got like the word, word, scripty words going across it. Nine bucks. So I thought that was cool. There's several marked down. Okay. What else do we have here? Oh, the Dainty Diamonds is on sale. This is one of my favorite embossing folders. I'm super sad that it's going away but it's like little bitty diamonds and it kind of makes it look like, I don't know, almost like a, when you emboss with it, it almost gives it like a fancy um, diamondy look. Like they're, like it's glitzy, but it's not. It's really cool. I'm really sad they retired that one. Um, There's tons more that are on sale. Oh, this one, I'm not kidding. Magnolia Memory Dies, $8.75. What the what? $8.75 for these dies. So even if you bought the stamp set at full price, you're paying eight bucks for that. I'm just like, what? Super good deal. Uh, the Small Bloom Punch, which I thought I had, but I don't see it over here. It's gotta be here somewhere. Anyway, it's on sale for $10.40. That's a great one to have in your stash. Um, oh, the brayers, the sponge brayers are on sale for $6.40. Special day. Let me find those because I have those somewhere. The special day dies are the ones. I already showed you those. Oh, hold on. Let me show you these ones first. The ornate border dies are on sale for $13.60. $13.60. So good. These are great because you don't even have to have a stamp set for these. These are like the kind of dies you can just use to use. You don't need a stamp set with them. So they create, I'm going to show you. Look at these cool borders. They're so pretty. I used these a few times, but probably not as much as I should have, to be honest. Really beautiful floral borders. Great for weddings, baby showers, bridal showers. I love this one. I used this one a lot. 
And then this is an edge that cuts out some of the other flowers you just saw. And then there's this one. It's got like a really small scallop with all the little stitch dots. So cute. And then it's got a couple flowers in it. So this one is called the Ornate Borders Dyes. And they are on sale for $13.60. So these are great value. Um, what are these ones? Budding Blooms. I, mean, I don't know where my... Oh, you know, I might have left them over on my... I did. I left a bunch over there. So the Special Day Dyes, they're marked down to $7.25. And they're the ones that coordinated with the little raccoon and the balloon and all of that. $7.25. Yes, Darlene, I am showing stuff that's retiring and that it's on sale because um, there is a ton of stuff that's on sale that people don't even realize. I've been getting messages saying like, I had no idea this stuff was on sale and I've been getting a few orders. And so I think I have neglected as a demonstrator to share that not only is it the last chance list, but a lot of the stuff on the list is marked down significantly. So um, I'm gonna be doing a full blog post. I'm gonna upload this video to YouTube so people can see it. And you can just go to the blog post and shop if you want to, and then you don't have to like go to the site. But if you go to shoploveandstampin.com, you can actually just click on retiring um, last chance products and you'll see it all there. Um, also, I wanted to just share, I am sending out the invoices for the paper party today. So if you've already joined the paper party, you can expect to see your invoice today at some point in your email. And um, I'm also doing like a last chance opportunity to sign up for the paper party. So if you haven't got to sign up yet and you're on my email list, you'll get that, but I'll also post it here on Facebook. Okay, one of my favorite things that's on sale is the craft and carry bag from Stamp and Stamp, for the stamp apparatus. It's on sale for $11.60. Do you guys wanna see that? Do you know what it is? Some of you will know, but some of you will not know. And I would wanna show you. So I'm gonna stick these back in here. So when Miss Deborah comes to work for me again, one of her chores is gonna be going through all this retired product, pricing it all and getting it all tucked away, safekeeping. I like to save my retired product for a year or two. And then I usually do some sort of big um, sale or offer with a bunch of it. Okay, I'm gonna move you guys. Actually, I'm just gonna come right back. Hold on one second. my bag. I have the Stamparatus bag, you guys. I have it. Oh, you know what else we're going to do? I'm going to show you guys some of the stuff that I've received recently. I don't know where my Stamparatus bag is right now, but I was going to show it to you. I have one and I love it and I don't even use it for the Stamparatus. <laughs> I use it for other stuff. But anyway, $11.60. Okay, so I wanted to do a mail call. And I'm also gonna do a giveaway. So this is just like some of the random acts of kindness stuff that I have received over the last um, two weeks or so. Ooh, good idea, great. It makes a great Bible bag, Jennifer said. Okay, so this I received from my sister-in-law. Are you ready for this? She was out shopping and she saw it and she got it for me. Isn't that funny? I love this. So let's open it. I haven't opened it yet. Should we open it? Do you guys want to see it up close and personal? Yeah, totally, Vicki. And if you're a demonstrator, you get an extra... Uh, 20 to 25% off of your what you're purchasing. 
So you're getting an extra discount. Okay, this is so funny. It's bad when your family members are buying you the rock action figures. Look at this. Um, yeah, I mean, it even has his current tattoo because he used to have a smaller tattoo on this arm. This is the current one. So funny. And he came with, it looks like he came with a shirt so we could put a shirt on him. He has a shirt. And he has other hands. So like he could be like fighting instead of announcing but i like him as an announcer don't you okay so there's that this is a birthday card it was a little bit late but i just have had it for a while and kept forgetting to share it this is from kathy one of my team members isn't that beautiful these nested label dies are retiring i don't know if they're on sale off the top of my head but they are retiring Okay, uh, join in the fun. This is from, oh yeah, this is from my team member and friend, Cindy Roadman. She wrote me a really beautiful note and she included a photo. Isn't that beautiful? Her and her hubby with a little lamb. So cute. And this was from, who's this from? Thank you so much for the gorgeous flower. So kind of you to think of us, Patty. This is from my um, upline, Patty. She sent this to me because I sent her a bouquet of flowers because her dad passed away. And I thought it was a really, really beautiful card. She did a great job on that. Uh... Um, Vicki, if you want to sign up under me and you need help with that, uh, I am happy to help you with it because you should no longer be attached to anybody if it was years ago. So just feel free to message me and, uh, or email me and I can get you all squared away and help you out. And then this was also included. I, I forgot to say this was included. Um, wait a minute. Let me get this right. Okay. This was included. This little bunny rabbit was included with Cindy's card. Um, I'm, I'm trying to, she calls it a, she quilted this, it's a bunny mug rug. So I can put this on my desk and set my drinks on it. Isn't that cute? Thank you, Cindy. I love it. And I've been keeping it tucked away until I was able to actually show it to everybody. Um, and then this insert was in one of the cards, which all of these scriptures are seriously like, I need these scriptures every day. They're all scriptures. Um, and they all address issues that I have. So I don't know if this was pointed like if the person knew this girl needs this or if um or if it was coincidence and it was just god like showing up for me but either way god still showed up through this for me so that was awesome and i'm gonna put this in my wallet actually so i can pull it out and remember it every time okay now let's do a couple of giveaways because i think that it is super fun to do giveaways. Oh, and I wanna mention, the other thing I wanna mention is I received a huge box full of daylily bulbs from one of my followers by the name of Leah. So Leah, thank you so much. Um, she was amazing and she used to own a daylily farm and she sent me all these daylily bulbs We've planted them, and so we're hoping we might get a bloom this year, but if we don't, we should get them next year, and it was just the sweetest gift, so thank you so much, Leah, for thinking of us and doing that. Okay, so today, our giveaways are the Circle Celebration stamp set, 
I'm gonna give this one away. And then I'm also gonna give away the, this was the stamp set from the last paper pumpkin. It's like got trees and flowers and some great sentiments. And there's a little bit of uh, linen thread and a sponge dauber. So these three items are one giveaway and then this is one giveaway. So you ready? Here we go. We're gonna do it right this second. Winner number one is Cindy Sheldon. You win the Circle Celebration stamp set. And I need a post-it note. Hold on, guys. Oh, did you see that classy move, me trying to get off the ground? It's embarrassing. Oh, ooh, I forgot about this punch. Okay, this punch, 720. Can you believe that? I love this punch. I am so sad it's retiring. I use that punch a ton. Okay, let's write Cindy's name on this stamp set so that we don't forget that it goes to her. Cindy Sheldon. Okay, and then giveaway number two. These goodies, this little mini stamp set, the sponge, and the linen thread. Ready? Here we go. Donna Meyer, her comment that says he doesn't need a shirt one. <laughs> I agree, Donna, he does not need a shirt. Donna Meyer. Okay, so those are our winners for today. Um, before I head off, I'm just scrolling here really quick. Before I head off, is does anyone have any questions for me? Questions, comments, thoughts? Do I ever keep retired product? I actually go through and I pick out a few of my very favorite things that I just think I can't live without and I do keep those. But the majority of it, I retire and get rid of. And there's a couple of reasons. One reason is because I simply don't have the space to store it all. So if I were to keep everything out and accessible to me, I would very quickly run out of space. So I try to um, just use current product or I try to not keep a bunch of retired product. And then if you wanna see my pants. These are my pants. Aren't they crazy? Um, so uh, the other reason is because part of my job is to show you current product and that way you know what's available from Stampin' Up. So imagine how annoying it would be if you were watching somebody and they used a bunch of retiring product on a project and they were like, okay, well you can buy this one or two items on this card, but everything else is retired and you can't buy it. It's not available. It would be very frustrating. Um, so that's why I don't use retired product in my crafting. Every once in a while I use something retired, but 99.9% .9 of the time I keep it to current product only. Does anyone have any other questions for me? Lilies are toxic to cats. Well, I don't think our cats are gonna go around them, one, because uh, of where we planted them. It wouldn't be a desirable place. But also, our cats are turning um, not feral, feral's not the right word, but they are getting less and less friendly because we don't allow them in the house and we don't do much with them. And remember when we got these cats, um, they their purpose was to hunt and they are finally starting to do that. So 
Um, we do feed them so that they'll stick around and so that they will have nutrition. And we feed them good food. I'm not cheap, but um, let's see what Rock's shirt looks like on. But yeah, they don't, they don't hang out around the house very much anymore. Oh, uh, no, Rock needs no shirt. Look, I don't like it. Don't you, what do you guys think? Shirt or no shirt? I wonder where I should put him. Do, 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 do. He needs a bottle of Terramana tequila in his hand over here. Yeah, anyway. Yeah, I'm with you, Shawnee, no shirt. The shirt looks weird. We'll just throw it away because I ain't ever gonna put it on him. Who knew at my age I'd be playing dolls? Okay, let me read what this... Okay, Rosemary says, this is frustrating is when the new catalog came out just to demonstrators and they start using new products and customers can't get them yet. Yes, I know that's frustrating. That's why I try not to do that. I do start using new product about... The week, like this week, I'll probably, you'll probably start seeing some new product, but you'll be able to order on May 4th. So, um, I try really hard not to just like gob up my stuff with new product that you can't purchase because that is frustrating. And the only way you could get it early is if you purchased the starter kit and became a demonstrator and not everybody wants to do that. Um, I do recommend it for the discount, um, a lot, I, most of my team members are discount shoppers. Um, they are not, Iona says, I need a caption that says, and here's Wendy. You're right. I should. I need like a little, I need them to be holding in the other hand, like a little announcement. Um, I'll have to work on that. Uh, anyway, so he, so I got sidetracked. So yeah, purchasing the starter kit is the best deal for your money. And by the way, I think I can share this. Yeah, I think I can share this. Um, then the starter kit, there's going to be a big um, promotion on the starter kit starting May 4th. So that's exciting too. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to wrap up for the day. It was super fun hanging out with you guys. Thanks for being here live. If you're watching this on YouTube, you're catching the replay. Uh, I will be uploading it and putting it there. And you can always leave comments after the live and I try to get back to all of them. If you wanna shop with me, shoploveandstampin.com and uh, you don't have to worry about adding the host code, I'll add it for you. Donna asked, I missed the game show, is there a replay? Yes, there is. I'm actually gonna be including that um, in my blog post today, but if you go to craft roulette on Facebook, you'll be able to find it there. All right. Thank you so much for being here. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and week, and I'll catch you again soon. Bye.